opinion there's nothing Celtic fans like more than commenting on Rangers affairs. And, vice versa. The two clubs are obsessed with one another, no doubt about that, and this fuels the intense rivalry that could go to another level in the second half of the campaign as Steven Gerrard's side looked when the hoops total dominance of Scottish football over the last seven years. This is football has rounded up some of the best tweets below, Rangers are desperate to sell to keep the lights on. They've tried to pimp him out in every transfer window Daryl. Even making up fake bids from China. John M. Allen, at GCFC John, January 7, 2019 They can't let him leave till he's equaled Chris Boyd's massive tally of goals against Celtic. He's only one short as things stand. Eddie, at Eddie Doc, January 7, 2019 I don't know, I'd help with that going concern, thing. Beans, at Beans Boy, January 8, 2019 Yet surprisingly no bids have been made, no club has made an enquiry, think it's more likely PR hoping someone comes in for him. Phil Stewart, at Phil Stewart 2010, January 7, 2019, he's away if a decent bid comes in. That's why Defoe was brought in, Brian Fayon. At 3 and Fay 1982 underscore, January 7, 2019 But they have to, geezy the Pez, at Gaz the Pez 88, January 7, 2019 12 million bid from China by any chance. Southside Boy, at Southside Boy 87, January 7, 2019 picked at twitter.com slash 2 and date Nexo, Ronnie Monroe, at Rondon Aldo, January 7, 2019 Tell me at Daryl Curry TV do you have any insight into how Sevco are funding these wages? Bert Lombardi, at Lombardi underscore Bert, January 7, 2019 Anybody that buys that guy needs head looked at. He's trouble with a capital T, Pat Gow, at Tickgren, January 7, 2019 Let's hope they keep him. Has never scored against decent opposition. Would be sent off every week in a league with impartial officiating. Celtic Nation, at Celtic Nation 67, January 7, 2019